right, we are going to do some posture series or carriage arms. Uh, we're just going to do, you can do half spring to one spring. I think Shannon's going to do one spring today. We'll do shoulder shrugs, bend the elbow, straight arms, 45 degrees, out to the side, circles and circles. And then we're going to move into 10 forward folds or little baby sit-ups. Um, this, if you have problems in your hips, generally people are lacking upper body strength and abdominal strength. So this is going to just start introducing that upper body integration into your center. All right, lie down. Did you want half or one? All right, she's decided half, we're happy. You can also do it lighter on quarter. Um, and these are also things you can do with hand weights um, or TheraBands as well, if this is too much in the beginning for your student. So short loops on your hands. We're gonna be an imprint and then legs up at tabletop. Good. Arms down by your sides. Remember, we want a little bit of space between your shoulder and the uh, shoulder rest. Lift the arm up as high as your hip joint. And I'm gonna have Shannon turn your palms in today, and that's gonna let you open your chest a little bit and make sure we don't go to an anterior tip of our shoulder blades. Here we go, shrug those shoulders up, and then big exhale, bring it down. Good, one, and uh, two, gorgeous. Inhale up, hollow those abs, three, and up, and a four, and up, and good. Keep it down, now bend the elbows, and straighten it out. One, does that feel okay with your palms turned in? Excellent, let's do it this way for now. Two, and we bend, and three, and we bend, and four. So this is focusing on our triceps a little bit. Keep those arms straight and bring it up. And now we'll do our upper triceps, one. So when you bend your elbow, you get the lower portion of the triceps, two. And when you have a straight arm, you get more of the upper part of the triceps, three, and your lats as well, of course. Four, and your abs and everything else at the same time. Good, stay there, 45 degrees, reach it out. And a one, reach it out. And a two, how we doing? Good job, three, and up, and a four, and up, and directly side. We wanna go wide, and we don't wanna pinch our shoulder blades together. One, so feel your arms separate, and two. Reach the fingers to the sides of the room. Three, and four, and last one here. Five, circle it out. We're gonna go up and open, one. Nice big circle, two. Nice big circle, three. Two more, up and open, four. One more, up and open. Let's reverse, out and up, one. Pull your knees a little closer to you. There you go, two. The further away they go, the more exciting it gets. Three, out and up, four. Do we need a break or can we go right into forward fold? Five, here we go. Arms up and fold forward as we breathe out, hollow the abs, 10. Lower down, look at your knees, nine. Good, and eight, and a seven. This is definitely a workout. Six and five. She's thinking, I'm glad I opted for half. Four. Three. Almost there. Two. And one. Delicious. Go ahead, put those feet down and rest in. All right. Put your straps down. We're going to do, take a little breather. I'll change your springs for you. How nice am I? We're going to do two springs on and we're gonna put the straps on your thighs. But let me change the springs first. Do, do, do. Okay. So let's get into it uh, carefully. So one foot down, one leg goes up. Now if your student is 
newer to Pilates, you may have to help them get into this. Otherwise, see if they can get the strap around. And you wanna go just a little bit, as high as you can get up there and still be comfortable. And then step into that leg and then go ahead and reach the opposite. Anchor in those abs, good job. You wanna make sure they're even. Now, when you have, I wanna bring these up just a tiny bit. When you have the straps on your thighs, it focuses the energy more on your tush, your glutes and hamstrings, okay? We may have to pull these up a little more. Try press out a little bit. Are they gonna keep smacking you or are you okay? Okay, all right, so what you'll do is you're gonna go to imprint, we're gonna stay in imprint, and then as you exhale, you're gonna press out and pull the knees up and get your tush squeezing. Do we feel it? And then we're gonna pull back in. So if you haven't done this with the straps on the thighs before, go again, press out. Two, it's worth a try. It really focuses up on the hamstrings up at the insertion, and then on your glutes. Three, and then by keeping those abs up and in an imprint for this, four, it further gets the abdominal hamstring force couple going. Five, and we're gonna try for our 10. Stay there, turn out. Heels together, toes apart, woo! All right, bend the knees, flex the feet with control and press out, wrap and squeeze, honey, one. Yes, are we feeling this differently and fresh and new and exciting? Well, maybe not completely new too, but maybe we haven't done this this way for a while. Three. So now you're getting the lateral rotators, but also probably a bit of inner thigh as well, yeah? Four, she's like, a bit, what are you talking about? Big breath out, six, and seven, and eight, and nine. Last time, please. Ten. Good. All right, bring it back in. How are we feeling? All right. We're gonna do circles. Now, you can keep your legs at tabletop or you can actually bend your knees more and let your legs drop down a little bit, all right? We're gonna go in parallel, press out a little bit, circle out and around, and then up and together. Feels okay? All right, go to imprint and press out a little more, little more, little more. Oh yes, now we're talking. Do you feel the difference? Good, down, 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 yes. So you can start with smaller circles if you like. Four, but this is gonna get the whole hip nice and warm. Five, do you agree with me? Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. We wouldn't want to skip the other way. Reverse, open it out, bring it together and scoop it up. 10, nine. This sounded like fun at the beginning, didn't it? Now she's working. Eight, seven. Almost there. Six, five. Four, three, two, last time, one. Oh my goodness, you made it. All right, take one strap off one thigh, and then go ahead, put that foot down on the foot bar. Good. Bring it up. Nice. Very, very, oh, almost there. There we go. Very good, rest. 